Now, I could say that this friend and leader had me at first bite or first smell, and that would be true. But if I have to be honest, I will say what had me was the words that she said to me. Because they went up here, but they landed right on my heart. And I thought, wow, this woman gets it. She gets business, she gets people, she gets relationships. And then she said, Bonnie, in business and in life, you get what you give. Please welcome Lisa Schroeder, Mother's Beast Drum Bar. Hi, everybody. Thanks for being here. Well, my main message today is you give, you get. I don't give with the expectation of something in return, and I don't always give for a particular reason. I just know, in my heart of hearts, if you give, it will come back to you, somehow. In Judaism, a good deed is called a mitzvah. In the area of giving, the greatest mitzvah is to give anonymously. The receiver doesn't know who the giver was, and the giver doesn't know who the receiver is. That is real giving, with no expectation of anything in return, not even gratitude. Give of your time, your energy, your money or your product, and you will invariably get back what you need in business, in relationships, and in life. My culinary career started through volunteering. I strongly believe that if you want to make it in this world, you have to give of your time first. In the food business, we call it staging. It's when you work for free, you either want to get a technique, you want to learn something, or you want to get a job. Um, I worked for two weeks at a restaurant in New York City when I graduated the Culinary Institute at a restaurant called La Bernadette. Worked there for two weeks, didn't have a job for me. Walked over to Le Cirque a few blocks away and was hired in 24 hours. Bottom line is, I gave my time, I got a job. I consider myself part of my community. I am compelled to get involved as a citizen of Portland and of this earth. I give my time to causes I believe in. For example, I am a survivor of domestic violence. I swore that someday I would give back when I made it. And so when the Bradley Angle House came to me and asked to use Mothers as a space for a fundraiser, I happily said yes. The event got so big that they had to move it to a larger location. I believe that just by giving, I will receive. Constituents and supporters of Bradley Angle House now come and probably support me and Mothers. My restaurant is located in downtown Portland. As a member of the Portland Business Alliance, we are all invited to attend downtown retail council meetings where we learn about what's going on in the area, impending events and projects, and we are given opportunities to discuss how they're going to impact our business. By just showing up, I help ensure that downtown is successful, vibrant, and inviting. The city of Portland benefits, Mother's Beast Joy Bar benefits, we all benefit. Where I can't donate my time, I find other ways to give. I always thought I wanted to be in politics, and have found a way to be political while simultaneously doing what I love. I give my space to political causes and candidates, and let them use it for fundraisers and events. I'll also donate my food and services. This way, I help put someone in office who will hopefully be good for all of us. I've used my space to host events to save Bristol Bay salmon and educate people about the potential negative impacts of Pebble Mine. Um, this Pebble Mine can impact the entire watershed that's home to the largest sockeye salmon population on the planet. I do this because by saving salmon, I help save all of us. I get as many as 10 requests a day for donations to auctions and charities. From basketball teams to orphans in Ethiopia, I'm asked to contribute in some way and often do. Mothers may get a mention in their program or a name listed on a table. It's not why I do it, but it couldn't hurt. <laughs> I did classes for the Oregon Food Bank and got to be featured on a spot with Bill Moyers. I gave with no expectation of anything in return and got a TV spot worth thousands. 
I don't have an official frequent dining program at Mother's Bistro and Bar, but if I see your face enough or I know your name, you can rest assured there's a piece of pie in your future. <laughs> it's not that I keep track, but if you give me your business, I can't help but thank you with a little something something. It's how I roll. You give, I give, we both get. I keep in mind the needs of others and I do what I can to help. I offer health insurance and 401k to my staff. They appreciate me as a boss and they show me through their dedication. I help and give to them and my business gets loyalty in the process. I share with you here what I do today not to brag, but to provide insight and ideas on what you can give. The ways don't stop here. I never measure or keep score. I don't need to and neither do you. Just give and you will get. There's no way of knowing where or when it's going to happen, but happen it will. Just when you really need it. Thanks.